Hey, brothers and sisters. You know, it's been a tough week. And I'm sure it's been a tough week for most of you, too. Um, you know, a lot of us deal with uh, mocking and scoffing. And people who twist scripture. I want to talk to y'all about a few things. On my TikTok account, I usually screen record certain people in post. The Watchman is one of them. Watchman here on YouTube. He's got a lot of good stuff. If you've never seen him, just type in The Watchman and watch him. It's, it's good stuff. Um, and Pastor J.D. Farag. I like him. And uh, I post a lot of their messages. Well, today I posted a message about Joel Osteen and how he is a new age pagan and backlash came i want to read y'all something and you can find this in your own bibles in second peter 3 15 and 16 and i'm gonna read it to you i'm you i'm in the king james so i'm gonna read some parts where you understand an account that the long suffering of our lord is salvation even as our beloved brother paul also, according to the wisdom given unto him, hath written unto you, as also in all his epistles, speaking in them of these things, in which are some things hard to be understood, which they that are unlearned and unstable twist, as they do also the other scriptures unto their own destruction. That's all it is. They don't understand, so they twist the scripture to their own understanding. Joel Osteen and many others make you feel good. They tickle your ears with a feather, if you want to use that saying. Um, it may feel good for the moment, but going to hell is not going to feel good. Listening to you ought to be rich you ought to uh you're gonna receive tons of blessings just send in your payment of 1995 whatever it is y'all don't fall for this stuff okay no if we were meant to receive blessings as who can i use out of scripture job went through a lot he lost everything, and then God gave him everything back. Triple. Solomon was rich. We're not all supposed to be that way. We're not all going to be rich. We're not all going to be greatly blessed in this life. Okay? I would say 99% of us are going to go through constant trials and tribulations. But, it's going to be worth it. I promise you, nothing on this earth will ever, ever, ever satisfy you. Nothing but Jesus Christ. If you have Jesus Christ, you have all you need. <sighs> Folks, it's, this is just such dangerous times. And a lot of the times, I know I'm speaking truth when I come to y'all. Every time I, I come on all my channels, um, all my social medias. But I have to check my own self before I come and talk to y'all. That's how dangerous it is. I don't want to say something wrong and mislead anybody. That's not my goal and never will that ever be my goal. Please be careful, y'all. Please be careful. Fact check everything with Scripture. If someone doesn't use the name Jesus Christ, if someone doesn't show y'all Scripture... They're just blabbing their lips. And it doesn't sound right. Don't listen to it. Don't fall in these traps. They're like bear traps. You will never get out again. Please, I beg y'all. Not a lot of people listen to me in my daily life. I'm, I'm serious. But I ask y'all for a favor. Please listen to me this time. 
Check everything with scripture. Everything. And by the way, my buddy um, who came back into my life, we met on TikTok, became really good friends. We talk every day. He's a truck driver and he made a trip from, was it Utah to Florida? Then he's coming through Louisiana and we're gonna actually hang out for the first time. And I'm gonna do a video uh, with the both of us talking about scripture. So y'all be on the lookout for that in the next few days. Anyways, God bless all of you and I love all of you. See ya.